decided to order, to commission some documentaries to make propaganda for their activities, which was mostly based in the down city and even in the place where the prostitutes were living, you know, Sharano uh, and uh, South City and uh, all these places. As I was the youngest director who had come to the ministry, because the other three, they have been before me. I mean, like in the military, they had their major, I was the, I mean, the, the little degree. one. Yes. Yeah, as a degree. So one by one, all of them, because they had some pro projects in their hand to do, or because they didn't want to get involved with all these, you know, dirty places, they said no. We, we they, I mean, they refused to do it. And all this time, I was praying God. I mean, can I have this chance to, <laughs> to I mean, to, to to be chosen as 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 director. But what I was looking after was exactly this kind of subject, subjects. Because I knew by heart and by experience, you can say, that this, this is the first time and it won't be repeated again. So what I decided at the end, because they, everybody looked at me and said, OK, you remain to choose. I said, OK. And from the day after, because I knew that if I wait and let the time pass, I will lose the lose the uh, opportunity and the chance. So really, maybe within oh, two or three days, I started with the uh, women's prison. And that was the first time in the whole history of Iranian cinema we could take the camera into a woman's prison and film the prison, film the people, film the prisoners. And uh, that, that was the start of the, of the whole uh, story about all these films which I made, and the, the, the film which I made after. Actually, I made the films very parallel together. And this is what I, saw, I, do, I do also today. And I like to do it. I like to, I don't know, it, it's very tricky, it's very hard, and it's very killing, you know, in a way. But I like to uh, get involved with two or three projects, sometimes with very different point of views, but of course, always dealing with the social problems but in different topics in different places and go and shoot, you know, one parallel to, to the other one. So after the uh, women's prison, I started uh, to make the film in uh, Shahreno, which is the new city, it was called, where the prostitutes l lived. And of course, it was a very, very, very hard place to film because we had to use the very, um, I mean, the techniques of hidden camera and. I can't even say candid camera, but very hidden camera, you know. And then at the same time, in the quarters beside the uh, Chardonnay, I started to make the films about slums and the, uh, uh, and the uh, I mean, the, the south part, the very poor part of Tehran, which, was, which meant very much to me because those films were kind of a letter written to the Shah in that period. And it was, of course, very uh, tricky to do such things. But you know, when you're young and you, when you are motivated, you go and do it. Because Shah had uh, was Shah was getting close to put crown on his head. I mean, to be the the emperor. And I remember that he had made an interview somewhere. I read in that period some of the newspapers, maybe Kehan or Etilad somewhere, that if there is a one uh, empty mouse, I mean one hungry mouse in Iran, I wouldn't, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't incarnate myself. So I said that would be fantastic to give him a major, yeah. uh, not, the, not the country, but I mean the, the capital even. I mean, with it. And this is why the film is called, called Tehran is the capital of Iran. And that's the film which ends and goes on with the people digging in the, I mean the slums, I mean digging in the, how do you say, Zobale, Garbage. garbage, you know, to find their food, and and ends with that famous, or at least very uh, black and uh, painful sequence in which people sell their bloods to leave, you know, and that was where the film was. I mean, these films were done very fast, very fast, 
morning, afternoon, night, every, every time. I mean, used because I knew that very, very soon we will be discovered and everything will be stopped. And that was what really happened. Because when the films came to the ministry, because we took the negatives every night to the ministry, negatives went through the lab, which was actually headed by French people and Iranians. And when the rushes came out and we started to edit, because in the same time I, 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 I shot during the day and I was you know, editing during the night, uh, we were discovered and the, the whole story was, came out. And uh, one day when I came to the ministry to continue my work, I saw that there was a lock on the door of uh, my editing room. And uh, so the whole story stopped and the films were uh, banned, stopped, banned, and everything was confiscated and uh, it remained till after the revolution, which is uh, another story.